Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of November. This is the third time I've done your reading already twice for November, and I just felt like they were too personal, so I didn't. I I just can't share them. I my 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 daughter, one of them is a Libra, and my two brothers are Libras, and it just you know. We're going to do this again. So let's just see what we got. What do we got for Libra for November? For the collective. For the collective. I did one yesterday. I did one the day before. I was like, oh no. No. So what do we have for Libra? For the month of November. At any time in November. You may be watching this in October. I do know that the timing is fluid. But I would urge you to watch this in November. So what do we have for Libra? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Oh, God. Three of swords. Three of swords because, you know. You know, I don't know what is going on for you, but I do feel as though November is going to be a very tough month. Okay, I can tell you from what I've read. <laughs> and um, I think you're going to be dealing with some, some pain this month, okay? I do. I feel like you're going to be dealing with some tears. Your heart is going to be aching. Um, yeah, you're going to be dealing with some heartache this month. The other two readings said the same thing. So I, I didn't, I don't, you know, I'd rather not, um, go down that road and I'm sure you would rather not as eat as well, but, um, apparently we're going to be going down that road. So let's see. What do we have for Libra? Three of swords. That's heartache. That's grieving, sadness, um, crying, crying over loss. I mean, that's what the other readings said as well. I still got them, but I can't. I just... Ah, the devil. Temptation. So te the devil can be disaster, okay? It can be. So I'm not sure if you, you could be dealing with a Capricorn. You don't have to be. Um, the devil is addictions, codependency, uh, self-sabotage, uh... Lust, greed, ego, uh, unhealthy, toxic. Somebody's unhealthy. They're doing something unhealthy, okay? And whatever they're doing is going to bring them some pain, okay? There's unhealthy behavior that brings somebody some pain, all right? So, you know, boy, is that an awfully big flame right there, huh? Pretty interesting. I don't think I've seen one like that that in a while. What do we have for Libra? What do we have for Libra? Be careful. Do not take risks. Wishbone. A wish will be granted. Well, that's one good card. Wall. Misunderstanding. So there is going to be a misunderstanding this month. You do, don't be taking any risks. I don't advise it. Considering this is the third reading and the first two were uh, not good. Um, but there is a wish that is going to be granted. So that's interesting. Um, be careful with your ego. Be careful with unhealthy behaviors or patterns that you are engaging in. Now keep in mind, this reading could be for somebody else. Could be for somebody in your circle. This could be for the person you're questioning. There, that devil card is, is not good. Okay, it's not good energy. This is tied to a situation. There's obsession. You know, somebody may be obsessed. Obsession isn't good. Okay? The devil is force. It could be a disaster. It could even be a death. I mean, I've got to be honest with you. It's toxic, unhealthy behavior. Hmm. 
that usually leads to some sort of illness. Anyway, this is a separation, the Three of Swords, or pain. Could be heart pain. Well, obviously it is. So what do we have? What do we have? <sighs> Suffering. It could be, I don't know, let's see. Five of Swords, freaking A. Five of Swords reversed is, I don't know if it's bloodshed, it's uh, revenge, volatile situation, somebody not listening to a warning. Um, things are going to change. Ooh, she's some girl. So there is going to be a change. Okay, this is, this is destined change. This is a, these are both fate. Okay, so there's a fated event. Okay, there is going to be a fated event. All right, I can't. There is, and I've tried to avoid it. I have, and I'm I'm not. I've tried to not even tell you guys about it, but the universe is saying, "Oh no, they need to know." Okay, there is going to be a, a change in circumstances. Okay, this is going to be a shock. This is a shocking event that changes your life. Okay, this is profound life change. You've probably been trying to avoid some sort of change. But you can't, this is going to, this is literally going to allow you to start with a clean slate. Okay, you're going to be starting with a clean slate. This is the beginning, okay. The Five of Swords reversed. This is, uh, I don't know, this is like, I don't know if there's some sort of, it feels like there's some sort of war or battle or fight or something like that. Um, five, this is like wanting to prove yourself. Somebody is wanting to prove themselves at all costs. And, and they can't let go of their ego. So there, we got somebody here that wants to fight. They can't let go of their ego. This is spinning, 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 spinning. Somebody's maybe spinning out of control, just saying, I just got to tell you, I'm not sure if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. Somebody's mind may be spinning out of control. Now, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but there's, this could be like drugs. So I'm not sure if you got, there's somebody around here that is on drugs and they lose control. The tower is a shock. Okay, this is a life change. So there is some sort of life change that is coming for you. It is positive. But it's going to hurt at the same time. Fresh start, starting with a clean slate. So yeah, you are going to be going in a new direction. Leaving something behind. One chapter of your life, one cycle of your life is coming to an end. This is the end of a cycle, the beginning of a new journey. So the, you may be moving somewhere. You could be moving. Something There could be a change in your living circumstances, a changing of your home or... Or something like that. Now this orb. This is all of a sudden. All of a sudden. I don't know if you're moving. Definitely sudden. Spur of the moment. Spur of the moment. Ch life change here. Universally driven. Three universe cards. Hmm. We got somebody here that has been choosing to stay in a situation that probably isn't very happy. It's not very healthy. They may have been obsessed or something like that. Now, I'm not sure if somebody in your circle... Okay, we have a, definitely have a circle here. Uh, is going to prison or jail or something. You may be dealing with somebody that is going to prison or jail. Whenever I see that Eight of Swords, I think of that. Four of Cups is discontent, sad, not seeing, not seeing an opportunity for love. You may be missing an opportunity. You may have missed an opportunity or somebody may have missed something. Somebody has missed something. I think we have somebody here that is very sad as well. Somebody is very, very sad. They may be depressed. They may be angry. That five of swords is angry. So isn't the devil. Believe it or not, the devil is the, sign is the signifier of anger. So I do feel like we have somebody here that is angry. Um, they may want to pick a fight. It feels like somebody may want to pick a fight and it may end in disaster. I'm not trying to scare anybody, but... Um, 
But this, this, this is an ending. Tens are an ending. I don't care. And this is a disaster. That's why I said that. This cycle ends, but it allows you to start fresh. You're free. This is freedom. Freedom to go wherever you want. Freedom to do whatever you want to do. You're leaving something behind. But it feels like you're headed towards some sort of mental turmoil. It's like you're going to be thinking about whatever has happened quite a bit this month. You're going to be thinking about it. You may be crying, uh, you know releasing some sort of pain you may be feeling like you want to be alone because you know what i mean you may not want any support people may be trying to support you and you don't even want it because i don't know maybe you feel betrayed or something like that there is some sort of betrayal here um that fool is a fresh start starting from zero starting from scratch this one is too You're, this is like starting from scratch and not being very happy about it okay i don't think you are going to be happy about it um two of swords reversed now this is lies being exposed something being exposed exposure of some sort coming out of denial this is also emotional turmoil we got emotional turmoil on both sides so we do have some sort of mental turmoil here okay in your head you're going to be feeling distraught you may be even having some anxiety you know, you may be having some anxiety or some res resentment, some sort of resentment over whatever change is happening. You are going to be experiencing a major, profound life change this month. This is an event that happens. It's very sudden. A sudden crash or a, I don't know if it's a crash, accident, surprise, um forces you to see something forces you to open your eyes and see you're about to see something that you were in denial about i'm sorry um could have something to do with greed because the, temp the devil is about greed um i'm not sure you could be dealing with a scorpio and aries uh could be anybody else capricorn Anyway, this is seeing the truth. It is. And I do see a lot of overwhelming fears and worry and anxiety. You know, very, why is this happening? That kind of thing. Everything happens for a reason. It does. Life is about to change. This is destined, destined to change. It's time for you to go, put, go someplace else. This is stepping into a new world. It really is starting a new journey, starting a new chapter. Oh my God, but not wanting to. Now the magician reverse is manipulation. That's powerless, not qualified, no resources, uh, not planning, no planning. Now, I'm not sure if you're dealing with somebody that is violent as well. It feels like you could have somebody here that has some mental imbalances, maybe some mental problems, maybe, I don't know if they're paranoid or something like that. Um, we definitely have very, very unhealthy behavior. And there's, there we, it feels like you're dealing with somebody that is very, very tricky. This person is a master manipulator. They are able to... To get away with things, okay? This is somebody that thinks they are above the law, okay? You're dealing with somebody who is, they really, th this is like a criminal. So I'm not, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but I feel like you do have a same reading I have done. I'm trying to avoid it, but you can't avoid it. You can't avoid it, and you have to, you have to accept it, and I'm sorry about that. Um, you may need to protect yourself. I feel like you do. Um, the magician reversed unwilling unwilling to change somebody and i don't think it's you i think you've got somebody around you maybe it's you that is unwilling to change this person is very very arrogant they like to fight they like to pick fights uh i feel like they're impulsive you have you got somebody around here that is very impulsive that takes risks that is going to do something stupid and and i feel like i feel like they you know i'm not sure what is going to happen but they 
somehow it's going to affect you, um, this person. I feel like you you got a criminal around you. May or may not survive. High Priestess reversed. Unaware. Lack of awareness. Unawakened. Superficial and shallow. You're dealing, you got somebody here that is a know-it-all. That isn't very spiritual. Will not listen to any advice. None. This is like the worst that can happen. The Ten of Swords reversed. It's like the worst has happened. Oh my God. There's a misunderstanding with an individual that isn't very spiritual. Be careful. Do not take risks. Thank God we have a wish is going to be granted. And this is this is good luck as well. This is a positive change. And the, it is. You may not see it as a positive change when it happens. But it is a positive change. This will break you free from some sort of fight that has been going on. This will end the battle. It will end the fight. Whatever this is, this fight will end. Major disruption. Bring somebody right to their knees. This is like somebody that is beyond health. Help. They may they beyond help, and they may have some uh, some uh, health problems. You know, chronic health problems. Can't can't get out of bed or something like that. Can't get up. Can't you know? Somebody may uh, not be able to get up. Could have some recovery problems here. Somebody has a hard time recovering. Swords reversed. There's a lot of fear. There's some sort of there's some sort of fear here. Fear, worry, anxiety, stress. There is. There is. With all, at least there is. There's a lot of fear. Fear of uh, maybe you're you're fearing disruption. You that could just be fear. It could be at this point because there's a lot of fear. You may fear that there's something bad is going to happen. healing so there is there is there is healing this is a breakthrough this is a new beginning this is happiness there's an opportunity for happiness here there's an opportunity for healing but you have to see something you have to see the truth this is a secret being revealed as well there's something that is going to be revealed that is going to absolutely shock you it's going to be a big surprise you are going to be surprised. Whatever this is, it's really going to surprise you. Whatever this is, there is happiness here because of this sun card. This is freedom again. So there's free. Free from mental turmoil. Free from the lies. Because there's lies here. Free from the manipulation. Free from something. Free from confinement. You're free, you're free, you're free. Whatever the hell that means. You're free. And I saw that, I saw that in the, the other reading as well. 
There's freedom. There's freedom to go someplace else. There's freedom to start over. You're free. You don't have to you don't have to worry about it anymore. I feel like you've been really, really worried about something. You can let it's done. It's over. The tower is a you know false foundation crashing to the ground. There could be an uproar. Something there's something could happen. It cause a big uproar. But that wheel of fortune is positive change headed in a new direction. You're going someplace. You're going, you may be moving. Some of you may be moving, moving homes. Could happen suddenly. Not trying to scare anybody. Um, or you may know, you may know of somebody who is leaving or something like that. But that five of swords reversed is uh, power struggles. It's power struggles. It's, it's uh, wanting to be right. Wanting to be right. Uh, Needing to let go. Needing to walk away. Somebody needs to walk away. They need to walk away from something. And they have been unable to because of some sort of obsession. Somebody has been ignoring an opportunity. They have. Because they've been focusing on a loss. And they've been letting they've been letting their mind uh, get the best of them, you know, their thoughts. But now it's time to let go. It's time to leave it all behind. Just like the universe says, you will leave this behind. You will. This is force. The tower is force. That you get forced. You get forced to <laughs> sever the cord, sever the ties. You know, somebody could, I don't know what it is, but um, I mean, somebody, not you, or maybe somebody around you could have an event where, you know, they have, a, they, they may or may not survive. I mean, I'm just being honest with you. I don't know. I don't know. Um, getting blocked or Something to do with sight as well. There's somebody's been, it's almost like there's problems with seeing things. I wonder if somebody loses, you know, starts to see things differently. Something to do with eyes. Change of what they see. Changing of what they see. They're going to start to see something differently. Yes, that's what it is. It's, it's seeing things, seeing things differently. Somebody's going to see things from a new perspective. They're going to gain clarity. They're going to come out of confusion and see. And see that they've been holding on to something false. See that see that it's time for a change. They're going to see it. They're going to see. See something that they weren't seeing. About some sort of deception. Somebody's been lying. Definitely. We, have a, we definitely have a liar here. Somebody's been keeping secrets and they've been hiding things. They've been hiding something. What they've been hidden, hiding, hiding is about to be revealed. Okay, it's going to be revealed. Everybody's going to see it. It's going to be a shock. This is a shocking revelation. It's a shocking reveal. It may make you angry. You may be angry. I think you're dealing with somebody that is very greedy and very selfish. This person only cares about themselves. The end of a cycle. You're going to be starting over with a clean slate. Leaving something behind. Not taking this with you. Definitely. It's going to be very sudden as well. This is sudden. I feel like you're... What a, <laughs> there's been a lot of fear. Somebody's been held back. They've been restricting themselves. And I, I know they've been refusing to see. But. Whatever is happening is the truth is going to be revealed very, 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 very clearly. Clearly. 
Somebody may be deciding not to go somewhere or they've been held back. They've been restricted and maybe they've been restricted because of fear. They've been holding themselves back, staying, you know, you know, when you be obsessed with somebody that doesn't want you or whatever the case is, it's a self-protection tactic. Somebody, if you, that's exactly what this is. I feel like we have somebody here that has been obsessed with, you know, something that isn't good for them. And they've been self-sabotaging their other relationships or other potential or new beginnings because of a toxic, unhealthy situation. And the universe is going to force you or this person is going to hurt you or they're going to hurt themselves or something that it, whatever happens forces you to break free from this person. You've delayed it and procrastinated long enough. It's like there's been too much procrastination. I do see disappointment here too. I think you're going to be very disappointed with the circumstances that happen. I mean, I just got to be honest with you. I think this is... Uh, you're free. And I feel like it's not something you asked for. It's like you... You weren't willing to let it go. You know, you weren't willing. You weren't willing to break free. You were, it's like a codependency. That devil is a codependency. You were codependent on it. Well, now you're on your own. You're on your own. You're, you're free. So whatever this is, I feel like uh, you're going to be thinking about it. You're going to be probably feeling hurt and crying over the, the new uh, realization that Whatever this is, that wasn't stable, that wasn't secure, that wasn't meant to last, is over. And I feel like it hurts. It really, 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 really hurts. Uh, it's a painful separation. It is. Um, I don't know who you're dealing with, but it feels, I don't know if it's a... Um, I was going to, I don't know if it has something to do with, I was going to say a sibling, but because of those children on the card, um, but I don't know. Anyhow, be prepared for a major life change this month. You are being pushed in a new direction and it is unavoidable. Good luck.